kings and queens it's your girl essentially k if you're new to my channel welcome hello if you're returning what's good welcome or welcome back y'all i hope you're having the most amazing day wherever you are in the world most amazing day week and month wherever you are in the world y'all happy end of july it is really crazy to me that we are in the last within the last week of july like of 2023 i literally feel like i just started my like 2023 goals like writing everything down on new year's i feel like that was like a month or two ago but we are here y'all um so as you read by the title today is a declutter day y'all as i mentioned in my last vlog like I just feel the need to like refresh and reset and renew my entire freaking life. Sorry, y'all. I'm trying to get used to like filming from this angle versus like here because that is just not cute. Like what? And it catches the light better when it's up. So anywho, I, um, I feel like I'm in this phase of, or space, not even phase, but space of needing to just completely turn my life around and not necessarily like do anything crazy drastic but also do some things crazy drastic because I feel like I've been so financially exhausted for too long um emotionally exhausted physically exhausted like spiritually like all the things y'all all the things and because of that I feel like one thing about me, y'all, if my space is like, if I have too much going on or I have too many things or too, just too much, I feel like my mind is cluttered. Does that make sense? Like I was a kid in the class in elementary school and even as a teenager, I was a kid in the class that did not have a messy desk in school because that would like, I would not be able to focus if I had stuff all over the place or too much stuff inside my desk or whatever the case may be so that is how I operate in my life so I don't like to buy a lot of stuff because I don't like to accumulate stuff if that makes sense um so we're going to declutter today and I know I've done a couple declutter videos before but not to the extent that I truly want to today so with that being said y'all today's focus is my master bedroom closet and my master bathroom closet. Um, I have not ordered any like new containers or storage. None. Of, I haven't ordered any of the organizing things at all, y'all. I literally made my decision yesterday, like later in the day. Excuse me, later in the day, to just I was like, I need to get rid of so many things in my life. And I was meaning like figuratively. I was meaning like all the stressors, all the like things that give me anxiety, all the things that are like weighing on me um I was talking initially about those but then I was like in a literal form I need to get rid of so many things in my life um anything that does not serve me has to go literally and figuratively anything that does not serve me has to leave and I don't even care like at this point I'm kind of at a place where I'm like I don't even care if it is something I've had for a long time. If I'm not utilizing it or it's not something that is of importance to where I, I will have to have this one day, it has to go. Like, I don't care about who gave me something or which I don't really have too much of that that I, don't, I think I need to get rid of. It's mostly stuff that like I've just accumulated. Some things are like old clothes that I might not be able to fit anymore that I was hoping to fit into, which I might still be able to fit into that size again but if I'm not active like my whole entire style is different now so I'm getting rid of everything stuff that I just do not need so I'm gonna show y'all some before and after footage I'm also going to show y'all a little bit of the during process but I'm not going to record the whole thing just because I actually had to work this morning and um I didn't get to watch my church or whatever like online while I was at work so I'm actually going to listen to this sermon while I um while I watch or while I declutter but yesterday I went to Walmart and I got these it came with um 20 bags it's 30 gallon bags and 
these should be pretty big for me to like put a whole lot of stuff in, whether I'm giving it away or throwing it out if it's trash or something. Um, I know mostly the stuff in my bathroom will be thrown out because it'll be like old medications, like things that are expired or things I don't use anymore, like that kind of stuff. So I'm going to show some before footage and kind of tell y'all what my plan is for the closet. My bathroom, I'm not really going to go into detail about too much. I'll show y'all just the before and after because it's gotten insane because I've been traveling for like the past six months regularly for work and for, you know, vacations and stuff. And because of that, y'all, I've literally just been coming back, throwing stuff in my closet, like piling it on top of stuff. And that is just not even who I am. And so I'm like, the fact that I keep my space so clean in my closet look like that oh my gosh like that is not me and so every single time I open my closet door my bathroom closet or my bedroom closet I like get immediate anxiety because I'm like I cannot keep living like this so basically y'all just see the before and after clip of the bathroom I am going to show some footage of the during process while I do away with my closet because I'm y'all it should be a huge transformation I'm not gonna lie I'm probably gonna have so many bags well actually i don't know because it depends on how big these are but um i'm getting rid of a lot certain stuff i just don't need anymore some stuff is still in good condition so i'll give it get a, give it away Ooh. but i just don't need to hold on to stuff and i feel like that is symbolic of me like holding on to a lot of what's actually like weighing me down Comment down below if that makes sense to you. So, we I'm not going to talk no more because I've already talked way too long in this intro. Like, whose intro is seven minutes long? Oh, Jesus, help me, Lord. Okay, but anyway, we're going to go ahead and get started. And I'm just going to kind of do like a time lapse thing unless I feel the need to stop the camera and talk to y'all in the middle of the process. Um, I don't even know if y'all have already said it, but if you haven't done so, please hit the subscribe button down below. Tap that notification bell so that you don't miss any weekly uploads. And yeah. Let's get it. Alright, y'all. So here is the before. My closet has gotten so much worse since my last little declutter session. Um, yeah. Um, so that is that. I'm gonna be going through all of these clothes and all the stuff that's up there, all the stuff that's up here. We are going to be literally purging, y'all. Purging, 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 purging. So that is the full look. And of course, I got like all these shoes on my wall. I mean, on my door. We got to fix that. We got to fix that. ASAP. All right, y'all. So, so far, I've pulled out all of these clothes out of my closet. I went ahead and these are all clothes that I am. This is like my first round. This is stuff that so far I am going to keep on the ground. It's stuff that I'm getting rid of. That's clothes I'm giving away. The stuff right here is stuff that I am throwing away. Um, and then of course I did separate some stuff over there by like work stuff. And then stuff right here is like sweatsuits, hoodies, um, sweatshirts, those kind of things. And then all my t-shirts are underneath that. And then, yeah. Um, so I'm gonna show y'all. All right, y'all. So this is this wall, like my main side so far. All the clothes are cleared out from this side, so I kind of wanted to give y'all um, a big, a better look without it. See, I have all that like random stuff. It's like bags and some shoes that I couldn't fit on my my um, door. And then this ba basket, y'all, I really don't even remember what's in there. It was like random stuff that I had nowhere to put at one point, and then it turned into like a catch-all so I really don't know I'm gonna go through all of that and then I have like important paperwork and stuff that I actually need to put into my safe down there over there so we're gonna go through all of that down here that green bag is like all dance stuff but a lot of it is older it's stuff I can't fit anymore or like dance shoes probably that I really need to replace anyway so I'm gonna get rid of all of that and then this bag right here it used to be all scarves um but I don't think there's even scarves in there. And the bag itself is like beat up and dingy and stuff. So I'm probably just going to toss it. I got some weights right here. Um, This is for moisture because of the issue that I had in my um 
my restroom a few days ago, my master bath bathroom, there was a leak from my ceiling and um, due to my, my neighbor's apartment. And um, I don't really know why I'm like talking with y'all facing the ground. So my neighbor's apartment had an issue. It was leaking and there was water leaking through the ceiling in my bathroom. And because of that, there was like this weird like water, not mildew exactly, but like a weird smell in my closet and in my bathroom. And so I put those little things in here and in my bathroom to try and like soak up the moisture in the air. So that is that. I'm actually going before I bring any of those clothes back in here. I decided to do like wall by wall kind of thing. Um, So before I bring any of those clothes back in here, I'm going to go ahead and go through everything that's on this side and get rid of anything that I don't need stored over here and go ahead and reorganize the shelves first before I put any of those clothes back in here. So let's do, oh y'all, and I didn't really get to show y'all the beginning part because like I said, I was trying to watch this sermon. Um, I still have like 30, 45 minutes left on my sermon. So yeah, or no, not left, like 25 to 30 minutes left. Um, oh shoot, my watch is on power save y'all. Anywho, let me see what time it is. It's currently 1.58. I started right at like 1.32. So I'm moving at a pretty decent pace. My goal is to be finished with everything by like 3.34 o'clock, y'all. Um, and that's including both my master bathroom and my closet. So let go. All right, y'all. So I'm checking in. I'm, I've had to stop so many times. Um... I actually had to stop and have my maintenance people come and check something out um, just in case. But all worries are gone, I guess. Um, anyway, so I had to stop for that. I had to stop because... Um, why did I have to stop? I forgot. I don't know. But as soon as I sat on the floor, I got tired. So I got to get the energy, y'all, because I'm still on one side now granted this side had the most stuff that side had the most stuff so i knew it was gonna take the you know a longer time or whatever um but everything on this side has been gone through except for that little basket um that i told y'all was like a catch-all now that's the only thing i need to go through everything else has been pulled out i've i've sorted through it purged it and um yeah we're making progress it's just taking a longer time than i expected so hopefully by like i don't think i'm gonna meet my goal by being finished by four i'm gonna have to probably push it back to five now but hopefully by four o'clock i'm finished with my master um closet my master bed bedroom closet and by five uh, i mean by four o'clock i'm moving to my bathroom so that by five i'm finished so we shall see we shall see. God, you call me by my name. Hey y'all, I'm making progress. I know, I know, I know. I haven't really gotten to give an update too much. And I think I've gone ahead and made the executive decision. We are not about to get to the bathroom today, y'all. I'm going to do a whole separate video for that. Because it is taking me way longer than I wanted it to. Um, because, you know, when you're, like, purging and going through stuff and, like, decluttering. And you have to, like, literally look through everything. So I had paperwork. I had... All kind of stuff I needed to get rid of, y'all. And I needed to make sure, like, I wasn't throwing away anything that I absolutely needed. Um, and so it just slowed me down, really. It, it really slowed me down because I had to thoroughly go through each and every single thing that's in my closet. So, here is what we have right now. Top row is done. I don't know if you guys can tell. But I put all my purses and one of my hats up there and one of my, like, carry-on bags. Right there. Down here is now empty for the most part. I cleared out my catch-all bin. That is not a catch-all anymore. I put my hats in there, like baseball caps, y'all. Um, actually, hold on. So I put some baseball caps in there. Um, this baggie is literally all sunglasses. I really need to get a sunglass case. These are like um, pouches and fanny packs. 
Um, I have a small umbrella, my poncho in there, and then like some sun, um, not sun visors, some hats for like the beach and whatnot. So that's mostly what's in there, like accessory wise. I have a belt in there. I have two belts, one for my coat and one like regular belt in there. So it's basically like accessories. I also need a freaking, what's this thing called? I need a jewelry box, y'all. Um, so yeah, don't do too much, but she working on a budget right now so we're gonna use this for now and then we'll get a jewelry bo jewelry box eventually so oh i've also up here cleared out um well that kind of is the same right there the stuff that was in that box i took out and then i put all my remaining dance stuff that i needed like equipment clothing all that kind of stuff is inside that box um and then i cleared out all my backpacks except for this one right here that has you know some stuff in it and i put all my backpacks there that box back there is like um books but i don't currently have like a bookshelf or anything um and my office isn't set up yet so i'm just keeping my um, some of my books right there until i like figure out a way or have an actual place for them to go um and then at the top up here i put those shoes that used to be on this shelf I put them up there because those are like fall, winter, and mo like those little, these colored ones. They're kind of like early spring type shoes. So I don't really need quick and easy access to them. So I put those up there. And now I just have to go through all these clothes here, which is really not that much. And then these clothes here. Um, which shouldn't take me much time at all. What's going to be the kicker, y'all, is this. <laughs> this random bucket full of, like, sweats and stuff that I need to go through. And it does, I do, I also have some swimsuits and stuff in there. But it's mainly, like, sweatsuits or sweatpants and joggers, jackets, that kind of stuff. So I do need to go through that bucket as well. And my goal, honestly, y'all, is to clear that entire bucket out of here. My goal is to not even need this bucket anymore. So I just got to go through these clothes, this shelf right here, and then the bucket. And then I need to put all my clothes back in here. But we're not moving as fast as I wanted to, but we're moving, though. We are moving for sure. So stay tuned. Drop a comment down below. Something I came across. Ooh, sorry, y'all. Hold on. Whoa. But, okay, something that I came across, y'all, when I was clearing out one of my shelves, I found my old tablet, which I knew where it was, so it wasn't actually lost, but like a year and a half ago, two years ago, um, I tried to use it, and it was kind of outdated. I think I got it as like a graduation gift in like 2015, um, but it wouldn't charge anymore, so I couldn't get it to come on. Um, I had just pretty much been holding on to it. So when I found it or grabbed it from up there, um, I was like, just let me double check and try and charge it again. So now it looks like it's charging y'all, but in the case that I cannot use it, like if it's not compatible with my, um, my phone or like, you know, if I, if for whatever reason I can't use it, comment down below if y'all Sorry, I was getting a call, y'all. Comment down below if y'all know of somewhere I can um, get rid of it safely. You know what I'm saying? Like, do you donate it? I know that, like, you could, back in the day, you can, like, return phones or whatever, like, so that they could discard of them, like, safely. But is there somewhere I can, like, take tablets or like iPad types of situations. Let me know in the comment section if you know that. If not, I mean, I'm still going to look it up regardless. But I, I'm trying to charge it up to see if there's anything on there that I actually need. Like pictures or something like that. Um, so yeah, y'all, let me know in the comment section if you know of anywhere I can discard of it. Because I would like to get rid of it. So yeah. we. I'm so tired, y'all. And it's 423. I was supposed to be finished with my bath, uh, my bedroom closet at four, but it's okay. It just took more time because I had to thoroughly look through everything. Um, so 
being realistic, this is probably probably the amount of time I knew it was going to take. Um, I just, I don't know why that was. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, I'm about to get back to it. And it's, like I said, it's 423 right now. I still may be able to be finished by 5. So we're going to see. Well, comment down below right now if you think I'm actually going to be able to be finished. And if I can't finish by 5 o'clock, drop me, a, a, like, your guess. What time do you think I'll actually finish in my closet? And I'm going to show y'all, prove to y'all. Hold on. It's 4. That's me as a baby. Well, not a baby. I was a kid. Can y'all see that? It's 424. And I'm going to show y'all the time when I get back, all right? All right, y'all, so it's 444. It's it been exactly, hold on, let me double check so I can show y'all. 444, can y'all see? 444. So it's been exactly 20 minutes since the last time I gave y'all an update. I did clear out this side that had all my clothes and that tub. These on the bottom floor is like what I'm keeping out of that tub. It's mostly swimsuits, some towels, like beach towels and stuff. Um, and then over here... <laughs> Is, it looks like more than it actually is, but that's just because it's kind of like oddly stacked. Um, but this is also stuff that I'm keeping. Some of it is like a couple dance uh, leotards, mostly sleepwear, and a few jackets. And then I think like two or three pairs of sweatpants. Um, I did not keep all the sweatpants that I had because most of them were faded and just not in good condition anymore. So I got rid of those. And then I have a couple of like tank shirts so i'm about to i'm about to show y'all this disaster this is why i feel like it's gonna take me way longer okay look at that y'all that is my living room right now and it makes sense to me i know it looks chaotic and a disaster but it, it i promise you it makes sense to me so what I'm about to start doing is putting all the clothes that I know for sure and 100% that I'm keeping, putting them back in my closet, like hanging them up, organizing them. Um, and then I need to fold some stuff, which I didn't think about folding when I gave y'all the last update. So, um, yeah, five o'clock is definitely not going to happen. <laughs> five o'clock not going to happen, but 530 for sure. 530 for sure. Um, I need to come back to the light. So yeah, basically I'm about to start hanging stuff back in here. I'm very pleased so far before I even put all the, all the clothes back in here and hang up stuff. I'm very pleased with how much I was able to clear off just my shelves and just, y'all, I have two garbage bags, two full bags, um, full of stuff that I just need to throw out or give away. So well, technically three, because that stuff that's on the floor in my living room is also stuff that I need to give away or throw away or whatever. Uh, well, I'm probably just going to donate that. I don't I don't feel like trying to find someone I personally know here, because the people I know are not like my sizes, the ones that are near me. So I'm not about to try and transport it to another city or nothing. So I'm just going to probably donate that stuff. And yeah, I'll go ahead and start putting everything back in the next time i come on here is when i am totally finished so stay tuned y'all we're almost there i promise i promise all right y'all i'm back and y'all my phone died but look at the result this is the final result so as y'all can see i got my purses my shoes some of my dresses and stuff my all of my t-shirts are now folded up here um those are just a few leggings these are all like work stuff for like dance and yoga for believe and the yoga studio over there it's like two pieces and shorts but here's like all my long dresses and rompers and jackets and sweatsuits and all of that stuff so y'all your girl is finished i am gonna say though since my phone died i put it on the charger and so it's like way later it's technically like nine o'clock i think or close to nine o'clock so <sighs> it's been a long day but i technically finished or i definitely did not finish at 5 30 i think i finished it was like 6 20 ish i think so um yes yeah, it's, it's literally almost nine o'clock now so 
we are finished and we are decluttered i know this side kind of looks the same to be honest but that's because these bags are um up there now it wasn't these bags up there before hold on something's on my camera Is that any better y'all it might have just been my glasses to be honest but anyway that is where i'm gonna conclude this video i'm gonna do my bathroom closet in a different video so please hit the subscribe button if you haven't done so and um, tap that notification bell so that you don't miss any weekly uploads and i'll see you guys next <laughs> back for the next video peace and positivity kings and queens i'm on my way to meet you we gotta talk all these trials and tribulations got me tired, I need rest And I heard that I can come to you when weary of my flesh You awaken me from death, God I need you No more walking by the flesh, that's when I leave you God told me I'm someone, told me I'm someone Told me I'm someone, told me I'm, told me I'm Told me I'm someone, told me I'm someone Know that I'm someone no, I'm a child of God I wanna go to Cali way Close to your love again I give my heart again, Jesus I wanna go to Cali way